What is up you guys, I'm Charmix and today I'm going to be reacting to SML movie Mr. Chef PB Head by Super Bowser Logan. What a weird friggin' title. Now I think this is a, a, like, I don't know, the title had like Potato Head, Mr. Potato Head in it, so I don't know what we're getting into here, but Mr. Potato Head is involved, I think. With that being said, uh, the original link's in the, in the description, make sure you guys go subscribe to Super Bowser Logan, and without any further ado, let's begin. I wonder what's taking Joseph so long to come over. Dude, 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 I'm sorry I'm late, but you'll never believe what happened. What happened? Dude, I'm skating over to your house, and out of nowhere, I hear screams, so I'm looking around. He has wings, why doesn't he just fly? Around, and then I look up, it's a dude skydiving, and he's struggling with his parachute. And I'm like, don't open, please don't open. And then right in front of me, he splats like a pancake, and his brain pops out. <laughs> Did you catch his brain? Did I catch his brain? <laughs> <laughs> like bees in a Mardi Gras parade. Yeah, you got- it's a very small brain. It honestly could have been mine. The brain! Yeah, dude! Now let's play brain catch. Oh, I love brain catch! <laughs> Come on, dude! Dude, go long! I'm Tom Brady! Catch! Ugh, I got it, I got it! What? Mm -mm -mm. I can't wait to make my famous baked potatoes! <gasps> oh, is that a brain? Hey, Chef Pee, have you seen a brain in here? It's right there! What do you mean? What, where did you get a brain from? Oh, my girlfriend told me she was gonna give me some brain, and she gave it to me literally. What? Do you keep your- I was waiting for a joke like that. I was waiting for a joke like that. Put my brains out of my kitchen. Get it out. <sighs> oh, it's so gross. Get those <laughs> brains out of here. <sighs> All right, Joseph. That was a bad throw. You're like Tom Brady on the Buccaneers, overthrowing everyone. Yeah, you're right. All right, you go along this time. I'm going to throw it. Okay, dude. <laughs> it, yeah. I got it, dude. Now that the potatoes are in the oven, just got to let them bake. <laughs> dude, where did the brain go? Oh, that was a sucky throw, Junior. Well, I'm sorry I'm not a professional brain thrower, Joe. Did it knock Chef Pee out? <sighs> Wait, what's Chef Pee Pee cooking? Mmm, it smells like potatoes. Let's see what he's cooking. Okay. <sighs> what? Dude, there's the brain! Wait, why is Chef Pee Pee trying to cook a Mr. Potato Head? I don't know, dude. He always makes... What happened? So the chef turned into, Chef Pee Pee turned into Mr. Potato Head? What? Weird, disgusting stuff. Wait, wait, Joseph, you know what I always wanted to do? What, dude? I've always wanted to throw a Mr. Potato Head into a ceiling fan and see how many pieces come off of him. Dude, me too! But oh. I never had a chance to do it! Me either! Let's do it! Okay, dude! <laughs> All right, Mr. Potato Head, prepare to go into the Blades of Doom. Yeah, adios, Mr. They're gonna wreck that ceiling fan, aren't they? Potato Head, bye-bye, Mr. Potato Head. Eh. Surprisingly, they didn't. Oh, you shattered! That was it! Dude, look! Mr. Potato Head lost all his pieces! I wonder where they went. Oh, dude, it's probably scattered all around the house. You lived a good life, Mr. Potato Head. Yeah, <laughs> rest in pieces, Mr. Potato Head. I've never understood how people can, like, have fun with Mr. Potato Head. What the frig- what is the p purpose of it? Is it for little kids? Like, even then, I don't think little kids would be interested in in, in Mr. Potato Head. Like, I don't know, it's really, it's a bizarre toy, if you think of it. Yeah, speaking of all the excitement, let's go see if Chef Pee-Pee's done with dinner. Oh, dude, I am hungry. Chef Pee-Pee, we're hungry! Yeah, and not for Mr. Potato Head! Yeah, we don't want to eat toys, Chef Pee-Pee! Chef Pee-Pee? Maybe he quit. I wish. Um, let's see if he was cooking anything else in here. Ugh. Oh, dude, it's that guy's brain! Maybe we could eat the brain and get some knowledge. I don't want to eat brains. I don't feel like being a zombie today. Mm, I guess so. Uh, oh, I know. Chef Pee-Pee doesn't like it when I throw- I don't know how people can eat brains. I know, like, uh, Why would you eat that? There's, like, it's just neurons and, like, it's not meat. I don't know. Threaten him with stupid stuff. Chef Pee Pee, if you don't come out right now, we're gonna eat that Mr. Potato Head toy. Okay, I guess you don't care if I eat a Mr. Potato Head toy. Or we break stuff. All right, Joseph, I'm a man of my word. We have to eat this Mr. Potato Head since Chef Pee Pee's ignoring us. I don't know, dude. It's kind of hard and plasticky. Wait, wait, it's a note inside. What, a note? Yeah. Well, let's read it. <laughs> All right, Joseph, let's read this letter. What? It looks like it's from Chef Pee Pee. Oh, dude, I do a perfect Chef Pee Pee impression. Let me read it. You stupid brass turned me into a Mr. Potato Head! Turn me back right now! It was a good impression. Almost as if it's the same voice actor. Chef Pee Pee was Mr. Potato Head? I guess so. Well, he did have a chef hat on. And he was cooking potatoes. What if he accidentally turned himself into a Mr. Potato Head? Dude, how do we turn him back? I don't know. Let me call- I mean, you threw him into a ceiling fan, so I don't know if you can turn him back. Oh, doctor! <gasps> hey there, you call a doctor? Oh, uh, yes, doctor. My friend was baking potatoes, and he turned himself into Mr. Potato Head. Oh, oh man, I've seen this one before. You have? Oh yeah, it's actually way more common than you think. When you're baking potatoes and you get trapped in the oven, you can actually turn into Mr. Potato Head. You can! Oh. 
Maybe that's why I missed the potato heads are a thing. Because there's no reason why any normal person would want to create something like that willingly. <laughs> oh no, that means Shep if he's Mr. Potato Head, what are we gonna do? Calm, calm down, calm down, it's fine, it's an easy fix. All you gotta do is put him in the freezer, that'll unbake him and he'll turn back into a person. All we have to do is put him in the freezer? We, we can do that, that's easy. Well, hey, see, the important thing is that you have all the pieces of Mr. Potato Head before you put him in the freezer. If he turns back into a person, you don't have all the pieces, then whatever pieces are missing on Mr. Potato Head, you're gonna be missing on your friend. <laughs> Whatever pieces are missing on Mr. Potato Head will be missing on Chef PB. Well, he doesn't have anything. He doesn't have his eyes. He doesn't have his nose. He doesn't have his mouth. He doesn't have his arms. Well, then you better go find those pieces. You're He's better off being left as Mr. Potato Head at this point. Your friend's going to be a vegetable. I guess he already kind of is a vegetable. <laughs> well, I mean, well, we lost all the pieces. We threw him into a, a ceiling fan. Oh, sick. I know. The pieces exploded everywhere. Oh, Joseph, we have to go find those pieces. I mean, we have, we have a while, right? Well, no, actually, see, that's the important thing. See, you only have about an hour to find those pieces, or he's going to be stuck like that forever. Only an what? hour? Why? Well, because then he won't be a hot potato. He'll be cold. Oh, all right, Joseph, let's go. Put him back in the oven, then. Find those pieces. Oh, let's do it. Problem solved. All right, solved. Joseph, we have to find Put him back every in the single oven. piece, because whatever piece is missing on Mr. Potato Head will be missing on Chef Pee-Pee, and I don't want to deform Chef Pee-Pee. Oh, definitely, bro. What? Ooh, ooh, I found his butt. Oh, thank God you found his butt. Chef Pee Pee has the nicest butt. Oh, yeah, the nicest. Dude, if I wasn't in the girls, I'd <laughs> just take a chunk out of it. Smack it. Yeah. All right, so uh, we're going to put this in a very safe place because we don't want to. <laughs> I'll lose his butt. So, oh, definitely. You go that way. The animals. I'll go this way looking for pieces. Okay. Okay, where could those pieces be? I don't want to miss a single piece. No. No. Oh, come on. Oh, Joseph! I found one of the ears! Me too, dude! I found one in the toilet! All right. How did one get to the toilet? Watch this in a whole totally different room. All right, so he found both his ears and his butt. Yeah, so he can hear himself fart. Ah! So now we have to find his mouth next so he can hear all the crap that comes out of it. <laughs> dude, we are on the roll! All right, so let's go look for more pieces. Okay. Hey, Joseph, did you find any pieces in that couch? No, I don't see any, dude. This is gonna take forever, and we don't have that much time. Hey, Joseph, does it, does it ever feel like you're being watched? Yeah, all the time. It's usually my uncle, though. But now he has to stay 100 <laughs> feet away. But it doesn't stop him from using binoculars. <laughs> Man, they make binoculars real good. <coughs> Wait. I'm not going to question that. Joseph, look! You see those eyes? Yeah, I see them. Mr. Potato has eyes! Joseph, how are we going to get up there? Dude, I have wings. I believe I can fly. I believe I could grab the eyes. Okay. All right, Joseph, we got his eyes. Now we just need his nose and his mouth, and I think that's it. Okay, dude. Hey, Joseph. Yeah? I see the mouth. It's on the sleeping cat. Dude, get it. Aww, look at the kitty. Hold on, it's awake! Looks like he has more scared of you. <laughs> this runs off. There, that looks like Chef Pee-Pee. Yeah, especially with those big ears. Yeah, Chef Pee-Pee has the hugest ears. <laughs> What are we missing? Uh, looks like we need the nose and the arms, dude. Yeah, and the mustache. Yeah. Oh, don't forget the chef hat. He can buy another one. But dude, I guess so. And we only have to find the legs because he never had legs to begin with. <laughs> That's true. All right, let's go look for the nose. Nice little fourth wall breach right there. <laughs> Joseph, look! I found the nose! That means the mustache can't be too far off! Yeah, because the mustache is attached to the nose. Hey, guys! <laughs> don't you like my new mustache? Isn't what? it cool? Toad, we need that mustache! No way! I always wanted a mustache. Now people can take me seriously. You understand. We need to save Chef Pee-Pee's life. I'm never to take Toad seriously. I don't care if he has a mustache and a top hat. We need that mustache, Toad. Aww. I, I kind of like this mustache, though. Well, look, we'll do anything for that mustache. What can we do for that mustache? Hmm. Maybe if you make a fire rap song, you could probably have it back. But I doubt you could do it. <laughs> Joseph, we have to go make a rap song. Come on. Oh, let's do it. That was a weird twist what the frig hey jo just beat him up and take it back <laughs> joseph what's up bro he doesn't want to give us that mustache back Ooh, that's a problem that's a problem i know i think i need to tell him how bad we need that mustache yeah he gotta give it up all right let me spit something to him okay we need that mustache really bad okay. chef pb is mr potato head potato if we head. don't get it back then he'll be dead we need that mustache you heard what we said what say? we need that mustache really bad please give how long is it taking to make this song like they only had an hour i mean i think I think time's gonna be up by the time they're done it's back we want chef pp back we need that 
mustache really fast. Please give it back. We want ship. How long is this? <laughs> How long is this? Is it over yet? Give it back. We need that mustache really fast. Okay, if you don't give it back, we gonna be mad. If you don't give it back, we gonna be sad. If you don't give it back, I'll tell my dad. If you don't give it back, I'm a okay. If you don't give it back, punch you in the face. What's my fish? Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Taste like I'll give you a taste. I'll end your life, make it seem like a waste. I don't have any new lines. Let's copy and paste. Hey, need that? I don't have any new lines. Let's copy and paste. Well, I like that. I like that. Dash real back. Please give it back. We want Sheppy B back. Yeah, we want him back. Yeah, we want him. What? What? Yeah, we want him back. Why do they do a full song? How long does this go on for? They didn't need to do a full song. Yeah, we want him. Give him up. Yeah, we want him back. Yeah, we want him. Yeah, we need him. Yeah, we want him back. Yeah, we. What? Whoa! I can't lie. That was fire. That was fire. Oh, here you go, guys. You deserve the mustache. We have the mustache back. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, yeah. I found this hat, too, but it didn't. Okay, so we have his hat, his nose, his mustache. What are we missing, Joseph? Uh, his arms, dude! Okay, we have to go find his arms. But, we, we only have like a minute left, though, Joseph! Uh, screw his arms! Yeah, come on. Wait, he wait. can get robotic ones! We can put them in the freezer. Oh, yeah. Uh, hurry, Joseph! Dude, he's happy! Uh, yeah. All right, we'll see you soon, Chef PB. All right, close it. Uh, all right, you just gonna wait a few minutes, okay? Okay. All right, Joseph, I think he's ready. Uh, Chef PB. Oh, no, before we see the reveal, I'm thinking that maybe this is whole... Just a big prank by Chef Pee Pee, like he wrote the note and then just left, or something like that. So it's either one, it is a prank by Chef Pee Pee, or he actually did turn into a potato. Pee Pee! <gasps> he actually did turn into a potato, oh my goodness. And now he doesn't have arms. Julia, what happened to me? Chef Pee Pee, you're back! We accidentally turned into Mr. Potato Head. But I don't have any arms! Oh, well, we couldn't find your arms, you know? We were looking all over the house and we just couldn't find them. Hey dude, look, it's down there! What? Uh, never mind, Chef B. We found your arms. What am I gonna do with Mr. Potato Head arms? <laughs> How's it going? Looks like someone's gonna get fired. Chef B. I hate you, Junior. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. You should be. Maybe if they turn him back into a potato and then put all the pieces back together now that they have the arms, and then put him back in the freezer, and then he'll have he'll be fine again. You know, I found a loophole. I found a loophole. Be more grateful. Like, you know, T-Rex has had short arms like that, too. I'm gonna kill you, Junior! Ah! With what arms? What was your favorite toy of all time? I don't know. I loved, uh, I love Lego. I love, even to this day, I still like Lego. I don't play with it, but I still like it. And when I was younger, I loved it a lot. I think Lego is probably my favorite. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. What a weird freaking episode. What a weird episode. I kind of wish they changed, uh, like, after, you know, Chef PB turns out he didn't have the arms. But then they found them. They should have turned him back into a potato and then put him back in the freezer. And that would have, you know, completed it. He would have been fine again. That's what they should have done. So I think that's kind of like a missed opportunity there. But, you know, whatever. Uh, with that being said, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up if you're new. And subscribe to the family. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Super Bowser Logan. I think I rate this out of a 10. Uh, I don't know. There was uh, some uh, edgy jokes, but not that many. Um, I'd probably rate this out of a 10. Probably like... I don't know, maybe a six and a half, but uh, with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Boop.